Hi everyone, in today's video I am back and not only am I back, I'm back and looking different but we'll get over that together, cultural appreciation. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry I'm gone. I'm sorry I'm gone. I'm sorry I was gone yet again. This is gonna just be me apologizing each time I decide to grace you with my presence. So by today's video, I'm going to be telling you guys, you all, you non-binary folk, <laughs> why it is important, the importance of telling people you're transgender. I know, big shocker, because I never thought I would necessarily touch this video or it would be something that I would really, really think is important, if not equally as important, of not telling people you're transgender because you've heard me tell you all countless of times with many different posts on many different platforms on why you should shouldn't tell people you're transgender so i thought it should be fitting to tell you why you should tell people you're transgender and that this is not to take away from the previous times of why i told why i'm why i told why what i was spreading about not telling people you're transgender because i still stick by a lot of those points some of them are a bit more in hindsight i've had more time to think about them and think about my stances on certain things but as a whole I do still stand by a lot of what I've already said but I think it's equally as important to tell people the right people that you're transgender if not <clears throat> just tell people just to wean off who is a hater and who is not in the most safest way because not a lot of people are worth your time and I've I've heard, and I'm just going to jump straight into it, like a natural, like, talking thing. I've heard a lot of people say to me, like what I've just said, a lot of people aren't worth your time. You are literally subjecting yourself to people that are lesser than just with their mental scope, mental capacity, acceptance and maturity of, of not accepting certain people and <clears throat> you're basically wasting your time on them by not telling them so you're inviting them to give your time that you're not going to get back but give your time and talk to these people talk to these men in my case and not tell them up until things get heated and then they just reject you or use you for sex and then move on you haven't really made much of an impact however on the flip side I have made an impact and a majority of the men that have come my way, pun intended. Yeah, like I've made a massive impact with regards to changing and opening their mindset, being a lot of their first and for them to come back to me months down the line, years down the line, weeks down the line and making an impact in their mind. I've had them tell me that, like I've made a impressionable impact and over time sometimes they just see the error of their ways which they once thought was an acceptable way of treating another human being and they've apologized to me and said that they're they're just better people because of my actions and it's one of the biggest compliments other 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 than okay I need to quickly, my sorry, my uh, if this changed, like my phone is being a bitch and saying it's overheating, so the flash is disabled, so I need to hurry up. I can't remember where I really last left off, but basically to surmise that point, it's just to say that you've invested your time in someone that's not really worthy of your time. Hey queen. Baby girl. I'm actually filming for YouTube. I'm say sorry. hi. Hey. I'm sorry, like this is the final time the video is going to like stop. Okay, so the importance of telling people that you're transgender, there's a lot of importance into that. Number one, your safety. Not everybody has an abundance of passing privilege to navigate without just being intimidated or stalked or hunted after by just hateful, hateful, disgusting people out there. But not even passing privilege can always guarantee that you're going to be safe. Some people can get really, really violent. I do have a story that happened a while back where 
I I almost forgot that like 2001 and then things got a bit heated in the sense that they wanted to like take me back and they it was it was progressively getting more than just making out and thing things were going to lead to blah 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 and then I had to like say it won't stop um and just let them know and they like were freaked out but then but then they still wanted to go ahead with it because they were so like in the moment and then so attracted to me and they went for it went back with me and then and then it just went a bit it went a bit off they got a bit like they went a bit cra like funny in the head in the sense that they were just so freaked out by everything and they just was like pacing back and forth and were just like having a breakdown but like it was on the violent side like they weren't going to attack me or anything but it was just like a weird situation and I had to like leave and then like tell the friends and friends that were with him and stuff like that so it was a very very murky situation and yeah I'm just thankful that nothing necessarily bad has happened touch wood to me so you can't always guarantee that and yeah it is important like I've always had a gut feeling and a good sense and good read about people so I've always known that I can carry myself in a certain way and be safe for the most part so yeah I think it's really really important to tell people that are deserving and that that means that if you want to bring someone new into your life you need to gauge whether they're deserving of that information because a friendly relationship doesn't necessarily mean or deserve right off the bat to for you to tell someone that you have to gauge like who they are as a person if they're worth being in your life regardless of you being trans if they're just going to be good for you as human beings so yeah it is quite important to tell people that you're transgender as well as not telling people that you're transgender because not everyone deserves it but <clears throat> for the most part you should be proud of it but it shouldn't be at the forefront of your mind you need to find a healthy a right balance and then and as of recently a lot of things have like come to my attention naturally over time just reminding me of okay a better scenario would be if you had told if you had done this if you had done things differently because I don't remember that I'm transgender. It's not something that I think about actively. It is what it is because I am a woman and you really, really can't deny that. So yeah, but I'm actively, consciously trying to be accountable for certain situations. And I just want to avoid ugliness because ill. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. This was all over the place. I didn't predict what was going to happen, so yeah. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you stay tuned, share this video, subscribe to me, follow me on Instagram because that's where I am, that's where I reside. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and stay tuned for more.